Sponsored data has been attempted a number of times in the past and we think that it has not been totally successful because um, there were too many inefficiencies in the way that it, it was done. The use case that we've been using uh, in the Catalyst up to this point has revolved around a, a shopping mall that is sponsoring the data access within the mall. Um, so that sounds like a simple uh, uh, situation, but there's actually a lot of stuff going on behind the scenes. So we're, we're managing a network slice, uh, which is dedicated to the sponsored data. Um, we're managing a geolocation, a geofence that has to be set up. Uh, there's a, an artificial intelligence element that's in there that manages the context related to the user and how they get dealt with from a service perspective. And at the end of the day, we need to calculate how the uh, settlement for the, the payment of the data access is managed. Um, and there's a matrix of relationships there between the enterprise who's actually paying for everything the service providers who are providing the data access and the, the users who are actually consuming it. And so uh, what, what we're bringing uh, that's new in this phase is that we're, we're really excited about uh, the fact that Orange is one of our sponsors and we're in Nice. Um, so this allows us the chance to actually build uh, uh, a demo which is really on top of a real network. Um, so we're going to be re using a real cellular network uh, when we're in Nice and that really uh, helps us to prove that the, the ecosystem works. Um, the ecosystem itself, we want to show how it can be based on the ideas that are in the open digital architecture uh, using uh, actual implementations of the TMF open APIs. Um, we have some artificial intelligence in there which is, is actually part of the ODA so that, that, that's uh, an interesting part too. Um, we're exploring the uh, scenario of there being multiple CSPs um, related to identity and how the settlement works there because there's a matrix of, of relationships. Um, and finally, that business model that's associated with the monetization um, is interesting because we have a kind of three-way situation. Uh, the B2B2X team has a monetization template and we're trying to figure out if we can apply that to our scenario.